another day in Medellin. We're uh, hunting for food. It's around, I don't know, I think it's like 10 or 12. And if we can manage to get across the street, uh, we're gonna look for a place to eat down here on 10th Street. Yep, early morning traffic. There, there was a vegan restaurant down the street here, but these guys are not into vegan food. Here's one of these buses here. It's going to the metro. All right, let's give it a try. All right. We managed to uh, get across the street. Now there's a lot of places to eat here, but with choices, then there comes difficulty uh, deciding where to get your food. But I know eventually we'll find a place. My friends are ahead of me because they, they went across the street a lot earlier than me. They're uh, more brave and they're not holding camera. That was like a salad place. There's Mondongo, that's a... A lot of people like to eat there, but uh, I had enough of it. I don't think I'm gonna try it one more time. And here's more traffic. You have to be brave to get across the street here. No, it's actually not that bad here. Nobody obeys the traffic laws, but all of a sudden they decide to obey the traffic laws, so I'm gonna break them. Wanna see what Monongo looks like? Yes, full of people. I ate here once a dog burger only because there was it was the only place open it was pretty good I had one of those fried potatoes with meat and cheese and all all kinds of things they add to it here's another place that it's late, open, so if you're uh, having trouble finding a place to eat late at night, Mario Bros stays open for you until like 4 in the morning. And this restaurant here is where they say, uh, they sell uh, bandeja paisa. Indian cuisine. You want, you're into Indian food, spicy curry, that's the place to get it. And Pizza Hut, they got Pizza Hut here. Not very popular, but they got it. There's a tattoo, tattoo place right there. And there's a restaurant there. Uh, bread, I guess it's a bakery. Here they have a breakfast, cafe breakfast. Maybe we're gonna check this out. Yeah, the menu looks all right. Maybe I'll get one of those egg Benedicts. All right, let's try it. What's the place? Cafe? That's how you get the menu from the QR code. My food has arrived and I ordered the uh, Egg Benedict's. We're gonna give it a try. 
Rodrigo got some fresh strokes and uh, Jose got some. Uh, what's that? Omelette. Omelette. Buen provecho. Gracias. Bueno, muchas gracias. I'm going to try this out. Yeah, that's good. The Holland sauce is uh, really creamy, really good. We're going to wash it down with our uh, tangerine juice. Check it out, guys. Grab some bacon from there, mix it up, get some sauce. Yeah, that's good with the bacon. We just finished our meal. Not bad for 30,000 pesos, which is uh, less than $10 for that breakfast and uh, the juice. Now we're going to head back to the apartment. <laughs>